streets may look and feel different to you the next time you're driving around the city. In an effort to reduce street takeovers, one councilman has pushed for something called bots dots. But one location where they've been already been installed has a few damaged ones. Eyewitness News reporter Jisha Patel shows us. You may have seen these small yellow dots while driving on highways and freeways. They're called bot dots, and Compton Councilman Andre Spicer says community members came up with the idea to put them on Compton roads because of street takeovers. The city started installing them about a week ago. They're currently at two major intersections in Compton, Santa Fe Avenue and Compton Boulevard, as well as Wilmington Avenue and Caldwell Street. It's been an issue in the city for a while now, as you know, they're taking over the streets, they're holding up traffic. Residents have complained about not getting to their homes for two or three hours at a time. Spicer says these dots prevent tires from spinning or burning rubber, which won't allow cars to do donuts on the street. We have not had any activity on those in those areas this past weekend. So Saturdays and Sundays is usually when we get the most traffic uh, or the, uh, the most takeovers happen. While on Wilmington Avenue and Caldwell Street, we noticed some of the bot dots were broken. One man says he got a flat tire from broken bot dots. It's very unfortunate, you know, that people got to, you know, run over these things and uh, get their, their tires flattened. So, you know, if the city can, they can come fix them or do something about it. We reached out to Spicer about the broken bot dots. He says he has no comment at this time. Spicer says Bots Dots, named after former Caltrans engineer Elbert Bots, have been helpful in cities like Paramount and Linwood. They've cost the city of Compton about $4,000 so far. Spicer says Bots Dots are coming to two more intersections in Compton at Long Beach and Alondra Boulevard and Wilmington Avenue and Stockwell Street. If the Bots Dots are successful, more could be coming to Compton.